Now, Nick Collins was a second-round draft pick by the Packers out of unheralded Bethune-Cookman. Tight end Derek Carrier hopes to do Collins one better this weekend. Beloit College went 2-8 and eight last season and has produced only two pro draft picks over 100 years of football. Yet, with all 32 teams showing interest, it appears Carrier is about to reach his destination he could only dream about. Of course, it's always a kid's dream that you don't play professional sports. Everything's out of my hands. It's just a waiting game. The fact that Derek Carrier is even preparing for the NFL draft is nothing short of amazing. Beloit was one of the schools to say, you know, you can come here and play football and basketball, so that's why you know, I ended up choosing Beloit. And definitely no regrets. I mean, I love playing the sport, but, you know, I could you know, really make a career out of this. But Carrier doesn't have to look far to know that despite the increase in scouts' interest, the deck remains stacked against him. Sometimes at smaller college, if you're a skilled athlete, then, then maybe there's not the same kind of competitive pressure. I think the, the whole having to compete for four or five years in a, in a major college gives you a little bit better background. I admit, like, Division three, you know, Division one are completely different levels of competition. Obviously, Division one being much higher. A lot of scouts look at that and say, you know, well, did he really perform as well as he could against, you know, a lower-level talent? But until you really can, you know, get something to compare against, you know, Division one talent, in that case, you know, 40 times, you know, bench reps, vertical jump, all that. I think that really grabs Scott's attention. Carrier is projected in mock drafts to go anywhere from the fourth round to a free agent pickup. The possibility of adding his name alongside the likes of pro golf star Steve Stricker as Edgerton natives to make it big is thrilling. But Carrier is trying to stay grounded and focused on the fact that what happens next is the beginning of the next chapter and not the end of his story. It's definitely crazy. Um, my friends always ask me, like, why are you so calm about it? Like, that's just my nature. I might not always show up, but it's, it's a blast. So wherever it happens, wherever I go, I'm definitely just going to give it my own. Carrier has visited several NFL teams in the past few weeks. Most see him as being in the mold of the Patriots athletic tight end Aaron Hernandez.